This latest Star Wars saga comes three years after the release of Phantom Menace, so there was plenty of interest in Attack of the Clones when Toys R Us held its Midnight Madness set. The event was for shoppers who wanted to be the first to get their hands on the new merchandise. There is an agreement of, uh, amongst all those who sell Star Wars products that they won't sell until the 23rd of April. And since at one second after midnight on the 22nd, it becomes the 23rd of April, Midnight Madness has become an event that uh, is the first launch of new product for Star Wars. We will have major Star Wars shops in every store in the United States and upon release, every store in the world. And so this is, um, this is one of the most exciting things that will happen in the year 2002 is a new Star Wars film. The supply will uh, not meet the demand at all for the first few months. And so the real diehard collectors who've been doing this for more than 20 years will come out tonight. If I leave with enough money to be able to pay my rent, I know yeah, I haven't, bought, I haven't bought enough rent. toys. We're going to be spending a lot of money, though. <laughs> Over $500. It's really easy to get caught up in this mentality when there's so many people clamoring for the same thing. You feel like, oh, I'm missing out on something if I don't get it, but we have a mature distance. I had all the toys. Uh, now I have a little kid, so I can buy him all the toys or give him all the toys that I have. and. Uh, if, uh, if, if I don't ever get another acting job, I can always use that stuff to put him through college. Vehicles and lightsabers are popular toys, but the most coveted items are the action figures. It's weird to have toys of you, but it's kind of cool too because it's really fun to, you know, make kids happy. And I just don't like it when my sister goes, hey, Jake, you can fly, and throws my action figure down the stairs. Even Star Wars creator George Lucas has his favorite items. I think the two things that I got the most joy out of, one was an R2-D2 cookie jar, and the other was a Chewbacca mug. You know, I still have those on my desk. Toy stores are packing them in, 